Let's get ready for the story by singing, Be Still and Know. Be still and know that I am God. Be still and know that I am God. Be still and know that I am God. This is the Sea of Galilee. So many important things happened by the sea that we need a small piece of it to help us tell the story. The sea is a strange and wonderful place. When the wind blows, the sea is rough and wild. But when the wind is calm, the sea is peaceful and still. Jesus and his disciples were returning to Capernaum. When they arrived, Jesus asked them, what were you arguing about on the road? But no one would answer. They'd been arguing about who among them was the greatest. Then Jesus said, if you would be greatest, you must be last of all. If you would be the greatest, you must be the servant of all. Then Jesus took a little child in his arms and he said, whoever welcomes a child in my name welcomes me and whoever welcomes me welcomes the God who sent me. I wonder how the disciples felt when they were arguing. I wonder how Jesus felt when he heard them arguing. I wonder what the disciples think it means to be the greatest. I wonder how the disciples felt when Jesus said, to be the greatest, you must be the last. Or when he said, to be the greatest, you must be servant of all. I wonder how the child felt in Jesus' arms. I wonder how the disciples felt about the child. I wonder how the child felt about welcoming other children. I wonder what it means to welcome Jesus is to welcome God. Now we'll hear this story from the Bible. This is a story about Jesus, so it's in the New Testament. This story is in the Gospel of Mark. Jesus and his disciples came to a house in Capernaum. There he asked them, what were you arguing about on the road? But they kept quiet. On the way, they had argued about which one of them was the most important person. 
Jesus sat down and called for the 12 to come to him. Then he said, if you want to be first, you must be the very last. You must be the servant of everyone. Jesus took a little child and had the child stand among them. Then he took the child in his arms. He said to them, anyone who welcomes one of these little children in my name welcomes me. And anyone who welcomes me doesn't welcome only me, but also the one who sent me. Now we will change the light so that this light, which is in this one place at this one time, can be in all places at all times. <laughs> 